Okay, I will walk you over SAP NetWeaver Enterprise Portal Assignment 5 which is on collaboration. Assignment 4 you have to work on it on yourself because it's a repetition of assignments 2 and 3. Okay, so I'm 4 I'm not walking you through because 4 we have already done those uh, creating eye views and creating pages and work sets in other assignments. So you are on your own for your assignment 4. Assignment 5 you have to submit three things, three screenshots uh, for room creation, for creating a task and for email to be sent. Okay, so first you connect to the enterprise portal and log in, then we go to uh, collaboration rooms and room creation. Okay, so I have logged in, I go to collaboration, I go to rooms and then I go to room creation. Okay, now what do I need to put in? Okay, uh, in the room creation wizard, I put in my RLU ID and I put in a description and then I select your, myself as the owner. I assign default category as the category for the room and I choose the SAP meeting room extended to as my template and then I click next and I select restricted as the room type. Uh, and for the room access mode, I have to do certain things also. So let me first do this. I do it RLU050. Okay. A room for Messi 3395 assignments. Okay. I'm the owner. So LU050 is the owner. So I'm fine. And then I choose default category as my category and then I select a template called SAP meeting room extended to. Okay. And then I go to next and I choose room type to be restricted. Okay. Now here I have to do room access. Okay. So As, no, select restricted as the room access mode. Okay, I've done that. I've select restricted as the room access mode. Then what I have to do now is I have to click on input help button for input field and I have to enter a search with LU asterisk. Okay, so let me do that. I select here. Okay, click on select. I do LU and then I put a asterisk to search. Okay, now these are my um, options that I can add to the room. I can select some and add them. Okay, so I am doing LU000. Say for example, I do LU001. Let me see who else is there. Okay, I see Liz is here, LU080. Let me see if Melissa is here, 045. No, so let me, okay. Okay, I see Melissa. Uh, okay, and I think I saw Roland also. He's in my class. I know. Yeah, I see him. So I add all this to my correct selection. Okay, so Liz, I've added. I've added Roland. I've added Melissa. I've added myself. Okay, and I choose. Okay. <coughs> okay, then. I have to choose next and finish. I think, okay, I choose next and I say finish. 
ओके वाइल इट इज ओके नाउ वॉट आई आई डू इज अ मैसेज शुड देन डिस्प्ले स्टेटिंग द रूम हैज बीन क्रिएटेड एंड टेक अ स्क्रीन शॉट एंड पेस्ट इट टू योर वर्ड डॉक्यूमेंट प्लीज वेट सो आई एम वेटिंग इन द मीन टाइम आई कैन ओपन अ वर्ड डॉक्यूमेंट ओके and i can also say a <coughs> and it's still wait working so let me do other stuff while it is working okay a room has been created so i need to take a screenshot of this okay and i go to my uh, i want to make it more visible as i always do so i go to accessories i go to paint i paste it here and then i put a thing on it and okay i will also include a loop 50 okay you need and i do uh, cut and i paste it in my word document so this is my screenshot a that i have created my room okay so i have created my room now the next thing is after that i have to go to collaboration rooms room directory to see a list of rooms so i'll go to collaboration rooms then i go to rooms directory and see a list of rooms these are the list of rooms okay and <coughs> then what happens is double click the room you just created to enter the room the following screen should appear okay so i double click on the room that i just created and this is the room which is showing up and then it says that okay you know this is a way of reading the rooms okay so that's fine i go to the room okay so now what happens is okay now what i do is i have to uh now go to collaboration select create task create single step task okay if you don't see the members that's fine so i go to collaboration this is the collaboration thing over here okay i go to collaboration i go to collaboration again then create task create single test step task okay now under single step task you can just put in a task whatever okay so let me come here uh you have to uh, fill up the form giving task a title a description due date and send so i come here i give it a title work to do today okay i assign it to i select uh, i select with lu i search with lu asterisk i search i see i assigned it to uh, say for example let me find out somebody i know check melissa okay i assign this to melissa okay and then i say okay and the task is please help messi 3395 students with their sap 
assignments okay and then i send it task has been successfully created or updated let me see if i have to take uh, anything from here okay so uh, from here i have gone to here and i just close it i close this also and let me see where i go i go to tasks assign tasks all tasks why is it not showing so let me see what's happening here okay okay you should be able to find your tasks here you go to collaboration you go to my tasks okay then here you will see all the tasks so you will see this is the one i created for, for melissa what to do today so this is your task that it is please help messi 3350 students with their sap assignments this is the task that i have created so i can go back here and you can take a screenshot of this task that you have created and you can submit that as your second screenshot okay now let me see what screenshot i was asking for i'm asking for this one all tasks okay so this is fine i can go to uh, here my task and i can just take a screenshot of this i go to my paint i open a new i paste okay now this is my screenshot i wanted this actually i can make it bigger i i can just do this and i do cut and i come back to my word document and this is my b this is my b and i paste my task okay now i come back here and what do i have to do is i have to click on the collaboration link also known as, known as the collaboration launch pad and i have to click on add contacts to create to add some names to the contact list and then uh, i can do it by searching and after i add them i would like to uh, basically email them okay so let's see how i can do that i go to the col collaboration thing and then i add contacts okay whom do i want to add from select i would like to search with lu uh, i know 080 is lise so i want lise okay and let me search melissa she is 49 okay okay i add melissa then i look for lise and i got lise i add her okay so i add these contacts i say add so they have been added and from here his auto detect status not available suppress status so let's see what i'm supposed to do i'm supposed to auto detect status so i'm supposed to select auto detect status so i will do auto detect status so after my contacts have been established what do i do okay uh, okay so i come back to my collaboration and then i send email okay here to uh, same thing i search for alu 080 
and I add okay and I search for say Melissa 049 and I add Melissa and I say okay so and subject is Messi 3395 and I send them a message please help students with their Messi 3395 SAP assignments okay and then I if you need to browse if you need to load and load a file from here you can do that I don't want to do that I just want to send the email so email is set now what happens now what do you have to show now okay your message will be sent to the selected recipients okay take a screenshot of the email that you are sending and paste it to the word document screenshot of the email that you are sending and <coughs> let me go to my tasks <coughs> Okay, before I send the email, I was supposed to take the screenshot, so I'll, no problem, I'll do it again. So, I will go for collaboration here, send email, and uh, so I can select, once again, LU080, which is Liz, and I can add her, and I can also do Melissa, which is 049, and I can add her, okay and then I am selecting Messi 3395 as my subject help students with their SAP assignments okay at this point please stop and take a screenshot okay so I take a screenshot I go back to paint and I open a new one and I paste it here and then I do my cutting and I come back and I this is my number three and I paste it okay so now I save it this is my uh, <coughs> SAP assignment 5 key and this is your assignment the rest of it is uh, your own practice actually you can do a lot of other things also with this uh, collaboration for example you can instant message you can desktop share and so on and so forth you can just practice these things as your own knowledge base but you don't have to submit anything from this portion so you need to submit three things a room creation task created and email to be sent